telephone call was held between His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa and President Mahmoud Abbas of Palestine. His Majesty King Hamad and President Abbas exchanged Eid al-Fitr greetings, wishing many happy returns for the Arab and Islamic nations. The comprehensive royal decree of pardoning a number of those convicted in riots and criminal cases comes on the occasion of the Silver Jubilee of His Majesty the King's accession to the throne and Eid al-Fitr. To speak more about His Majesty the King's pardon, we are joined by the Managing Director of Diplomacy Plus, Stephen Jones. Well, of course, it's not unusual in the Gulf region to see gestures of generosity and even gestures of mercy and reconciliation from rulers to coincide with the end of the holy month of Ramadan. But I think this is really quite significant in the context of Bahrain's unique situation. I mean, even just taking the charges that these individuals were convicted of, rioting, for example, this is a relatively unusual criminal charge in the Gulf. You don't often hear of riots taking place in these mainly harmonious societies. So the way in which the king has approached this, I think is a reflection both of his leadership as a monarch and as a Muslim, but also a reflection, I would say, of his determination that Bahrain should move forward as a nation. We've seen some significant incremental positive changes in society in Bahrain in the years since then. And these, so this is really quite a landmark decision to pardon these individuals who were convicted of very serious crimes of violence. Coinciding with the celebration of the Silver Jubilee of the 25th anniversary of His Majesty the King's accession to the throne, and in celebration of Eid al-Fitr, a number of major buildings and landmarks in Bahrain were decorated with the image of His Majesty the King and the Silver Jubilee logo. A number of major buildings in the capital, Manama, were also seen lit up in red and white to celebrate the two occasions. This initiative continues during the days of Eid al-Fitr and the following days to share joy with citizens and to introduce visitors to this national occasion that is celebrated until the end of the year.